Hello! So today, we're gonna have a little bit of, a uh, story time. <laughs> How my friends found out that I was a furry. Alright, this will... This is so bad when they happened. It was kind of scary, but, um, I'm friends still with all these people. And they're good enough not to, like, judge me too hard, but... Yeah, it still... Still wasn't really that fun. <laughs> okay, so basically for the first one, what my friend did is... Right, so I'm a fursuit maker. I make fursuits, and I'm, I'm not huge, but... Once in a while I'll take some commissions and I'll make pre-mates. And, uh, I made my suit. This is... My work. And, um... Anyway, so my room is always a mess, because... It's full of fur and foam and... Different stages of fursuits. So... You could... I was a furry because like look right here Bam I have a I have a little ferret guy that I've been making Which he will be for sale uh, He'll be a full suit actually fun fact, but uh anyway, so I had some you know sim just in my room because that's that's my workshop and uh, And she she came over and we were talking and stuff, she's like, oh, I want to see your room. No! God, please, <sighs> and, uh, no! No! I, I didn't want her to see my room, because then she'd know I'd be a furry. And I've heard her talk about furries before in a very, very bad way. And, like, and I didn't want her to think bad of me. At all. And so this person, being very, like, headstrong and kind of doesn't listen to me, she, uh... She decided, well, I'm gonna go take a look in your room. I said, uh, no, it's, uh, it's, it's messy, so how about, how about we, we go upstairs somewhere else? She's like, nah, it's okay, I don't, I don't mind. And I was like, um, panic, panic. So, um, anyway, so she, you know, grabbed, I saw her grab my door handle, and my heart just was like, <laughs> and she opened it, and the look on her face, it was so bad. She was like, uh. Yeah, so it it turned out okay. She was like, oh, whoa. This is cool. And then I talked about my business and stuff. And she was like, oh, actually, that's that's cool. Um, okay. <laughs> that's basically how that happened with that friend is she just walked right into my workroom and saw my fursuits. We're still good friends. And, um... <laughs> See, I, I guess I made the excuse of, oh, don't worry, I'm not a furry, I just make fursuits, you know? And she's like, oh, that makes sense. <laughs> so, um, oh gosh, yeah, that's bad, but, uh, we're still on good terms, and, uh, I suppose that's what matters. <laughs> All right, now for my second friend, um, this one was not quite as bad or alarming, but I was on the bus, and... <laughs> He was, he was sitting behind me, right? He's usually just on his phone. Everyone's just kind of like on their phones, right? So, you know, I was scrolling and through Instagram and right, um, <laughs> furry Instagram. There's furries everywhere and my feed is full of fursuits and art. So, he saw me scrolling through all that and liking textures and he was like, hey, what's that? And I was like, um, oh, it's just, um... Uh, it's just, you know, whatever, don't, don't, don't Disney cartoon thing, you know, y y yeah, and he was like, oh, hmm, and then later I found it, he's actually a furry, so, it worked out, it and then another time was, basically, I love to draw, right, I'm an artist, I paint and draw and make things, and, well, one day at school, I was sitting, just sitting at the table, my desk, you know, drawing furries, because I love to do that, and it's enjoyable, and I know what I'm doing. But sometimes I don't like when people look at my work, because either I don't think it's good enough, or they'll judge me for it. <laughs> and my friend, like, was sitting next to me, and she saw me draw all kinds of things and stuff, but she just kind of looked at it and kind of looked back at me, and I was like, Yes? And she was like, 
Wait. Are you... Are you a furry? You a furry? <laughs> I was like, I was... Uh, no, no, I'm not a furry. It's... Uh, I, I like Disney character Disney characters, you know, the animals that like human traits, you know, uh, uh, yeah, that, that stuff. And she was like, oh, no, I think you're a furry. And I was like, oh, maybe, I just, nah, I, you know, now that I think about it, I blame Disney for a lot of my, uh, my furriness, but also it's a nice excuse because people accept Disney, Disney characters who are furries, anthropomorphic animals, yet they don't accept us. <sighs> it doesn't make sense, but hey, it worked out for me and helped me in quite a few scenarios in my life. <laughs> Real quick, I have started a Patreon so that you can support me and my furry content. If you are interested, go ahead. It is in the link below. Check it out. There is rewards, all kinds of things. Just take a look. Now, back to the video. All right, and then my <laughs> my next one is I accidentally posted a picture of my fursuit on my main main Instagram account for like my my you know my my personal my human Instagram. I thought I was on my furry account and not my human real one. <laughs> Luckily, I caught it. I saw one like by this one person. It was my friend. And as soon as I saw that, I was like, wait. Wait, hold on. And I did the math. And, uh, uh wrong account, wrong account. <laughs> I've done this with stories, too. But luckily, um, I, I deleted them before people saw. But, <laughs> yeah, they've never, like, talked to me about it. But they saw it and they liked it. So, I don't know how to feel about that, really. But, uh... <laughs> It, uh, I guess it was okay. And then the last experience was crazy. The best one. Okay. So, <laughs> I'm on Instagram, right? And I'm looking at the people who've DM'd me. And I was like, you know, I was talking to this one person because she drew me fan art. This piece. Very lovely piece. I loved it. Very, I love the traditional hand-drawn art. That was very thoughtful of her. Anyway, so, she sends me this and we talk a little bit. And then she's like, wait, you look kind of familiar. Like, because part of my face was shown in one of my Instagram posts, this one, and she recognized me. Or, um, or from my suit up video, she recognized me and was like, hey, I think I might know you. And I was like, wait, are you, are you sure? Um, I don't, I don't know. Like, who, who are you? And she said her name. I was like, oh my gosh. I think, I think this is from a kid from school. They found me, and I was like, wait, but they drew me fan art, so, and they follow me, and they like my stuff, so, wait, is there just a furry at my school who found me, and, and it's okay, because they're a furry too? And that's exactly what happened. So, that was great how that worked out. So glad she's a furry too. Thanks for watching the video of the different experiences I've had with people finding out how I am a furry. So, uh, tune in next week for a video and, uh, bye!